Hi and welcome to today's new quick tip. This is Pedro Flores for VFX Launchbox. So what we're going to do today, um, we're going to go ahead and go over the bookmarking system inside of New. And it's very simple. Every time you create a new backdrop node, that backdrop node will have a little tick right here that says bookmark. So the most important thing about it is making sure that you have a label for that backdrop node and it's something that is descriptive. So the purpose of that is to be able to jump from location to location on your script and very quickly and very efficiently. So if we are down at the bottom, we will be able to jump to the top if by some reason we need to access that section. So let's go ahead and use this. After we have all the backdrop nodes, this will keep our script organized and readable. So in order to jump from location to location, it's very simple. What we're going to do is we're going to hit J on our keyboard. It's the same as accessing the tap. So you will see if you hit the tap, you will access your node. If you hit J, you will be accessing uh, your backdrops, in this case, your bookmarks. So with doing this, you could go and jump from location to location very, very quickly. Hitting J again, I could go ahead and find any of the location on my backdrop. Say I want to go back to my source asset. Or I want to find a filter that I'm working on or if, making sure that I made everything broadcast safe or legal. Um, so essentially, we could jump back and forth between locations uh, in our element very, very quickly and very, very efficiently. Um, and that way, it's proof our speed. So it's a feature that is kind of overlooked by a lot of compositors, and uh, it's kind of very, very useful. So this has been all for today's uh, quick tip. I hope you guys like it. And this has been Peter Forrest for VFS Longbox. Take care. Bye-bye.